Hello everyone, I'm Hao Ran Chen. I'm very happy to present our paper, Panoptic Vision Language Feature Fields. In this paper, we aim to build a system for 3D open vocabulary panoptic mapping. Neural radiance field has been proven as a powerful tool to model complex 3D scenes based on a set of 2D images. In order to understand a scene, we propose panoptic vision language feature fields, PVLFF, which learns a radiance field from post images and simultaneously learns semantic and instance feature fields from 2D proposals computed by pre-trained models. In our method, we use LSAC to pre-compute vision language embeddings for semantic feature learning, and we use SAM as the instance segmenter to pre-compute masks for instance feature learning. Once trained, PBLFF can predict semantic and instance segmentation of the 3D scene. Moreover, our model understands language queries, thus produces an open vocabulary panoptic segmentation. Specifically, given a 3D position and a viewing direction, PVLFF encodes a 3D volume of color and density to model a radiance field of the scene. We stack a lightweight multi-layer perception to predict semantic feature field for the 3D space. In addition, we parameterize the instance feature field on a different branch. We empirically find that this setting largely increases the quality of instance features and improves the system robustness. To learn semantic feature field, we derive the rendered semantic feature and apply a L1 loss to distill the pre-computed vision language embeddings from the pre-trained LSAC 2D model into the semantic feature field. For instance feature learning, we predict a rendered instance feature for every pixel. With the instance masks pre-computed by SAM, we apply a contrastive loss to encourage features within the same instance to be close while pushing away features from different instances. Additionally, to further encourage features within an instance to be close to each other, we adopt a slow center strategy. By estimating the average feature of every instance mask as the center feature for each instance, and we penalize rendered instance feature from the same mask to be close to the center. It is worth mentioning that the instance feature learning is applied on the rendered viewpoints. Despite the absence of any form of association, such as instance IDs, between masks that correspond to the same instance across frames, the underlying reconstructed geometry of PVLFF naturally encourages the features of an instance in different viewpoints to have high similarity upon convergence. For inference, we use the same vision language model to encode the language queries. Combined with the rendered semantic feature, we can predict semantic segmentation of the scene on the open vocabulary language queries. For instance segmentation, we use a clustering algorithm to directly segment instance features. In our experiments, we use HDB scan. We further fuse the instance segmentation with the semantic segmentation by denoising the semantics inside an instance using majority voting. Here we show the visualized results of a replica scene. Our method can segment instances consistently in 3D based on 2D training views. Take the TV screen for example, the semantic and instance features are multi-view consistent. Since we use SAM to pre-compute masks, our method tends to segment objects into subparts. For example, we segment the ceiling into different tiles. Here are more visualization results.
Moreover, our instance feature field is built upon the object agnostic masks, which can be masks of multi-level parts of an instance. Therefore, after contrastive learning on 2D instance masks, the instance features exhibit a hierarchical structure, enabling instance computation at different scales. Here we run HDB scan on rendered instance features and visualized clustering results. In the clustering tree, each colored node represents a predicted instance. We can recover different levels of instance predictions from the clustering tree. We show the multi-level predictions from the finest to complete segmentation. We tested our method quantitatively on different benchmarks to evaluate panoptic segmentation performance in 3D scenes. We will report scene level panoptic quality and mean intersection over Yulian to evaluate the panoptic and semantic segmentation respectively. To the best of our knowledge, no previous method is capable of open vocabulary panoptic segmentation for 3D scenes. Therefore, we compare our method with previous closed set 3D panoptic segmentation methods. Though not fully on par with the best baselines, our method achieves comparable semantic segmentation scores without any training labels. As for panoptic segmentation, our scores are slightly lower. We observe that this is largely due to the fact that unlike these closed set systems which are trained on the specific classes evaluated, BVLFF does not rely on any semantic or instance labels during training. Moreover, we note that defining the boundaries of a previously unseen instance is inherently an ear post problem. It is not possible to guarantee that the detected boundaries will reflect those defined in the ground truth data. Nonetheless, our method knows hierarchical instance features which can be used to produce panoptic segmentations of different granularities. We also compare PVLFF against current zero-shot systems for open vocabulary semantic segmentation for 3D scenes. We evaluate the semantic segmentation performance in 3D space for point clouds. We achieve the best mean IOU and the near best mean accuracy. On 2D views, our method also achieves the best semantic segmentation performance. In conclusion, our method PBLFF is the first open vocabulary 3D panoptic segmentation system. It optimizes a semantic feature field using knowledge destination on 2D vision language embeddings, and simultaneously optimizes an instance feature field by contrastive learning on pre-computed multi-level 2D masks. Once trained, our method is able to perform scene-level panoptic segmentation. Please check more details on our website and code repository.